and welcome to the first episode of the fried and pickled beet. So what's up for the first episode? Well, it's Mother's Day coming up this week and I thought we'd make a very simple keto-friendly quiche. Nice. Our organic asparagus is absolutely beautiful right now, so I thought we'd add it in. You're just gonna take a small bunch, coat it with a little bit of olive oil, sprinkle it with sea salt, and grill it until lightly browned and tender. How's this look, Mila? Looks perfect, Steve. We're gonna start with a crust, and what makes this one keto-friendly is it's made out of cauliflower. So I took one small head, steamed it, threw it in this bowl. Steve, I'm gonna get you to mash it up just like potatoes. This is gonna be drawing out a lot of liquid, so we're gonna make sure to strain it with cheesecloth. At Edible Island, we sell this organic, unbleached cheesecloth, which works perfectly for the job. We're just gonna put it in a colander to make it easier. You're basically gonna hold on to that and squeeze all the liquid out. Apply a little pressure and make sure it's as dry as can be. <laughs> Quiche obviously incorporates eggs. Today, I've chosen to use the Mountain View Farms local eggs. Three of those guys, a quarter cup, of cream, two thirds cup of freshly grated Parmesan cheese, <laughs> and a quarter cup of almond flour, which is basically just ground up almonds. All these ingredients thrown together with the cauliflower to form our crust. Nice. Go at it, Steve. All right. Time to form it. Take a little dip in there, and there you go. Bake at 375 for 20 minutes. Easy peasy. So now we take this beautiful asparagus you grilled up, chop it up fine. Nice. I can do that. Chopping's easy. Steve. Voila. Steve. Asparagus right. a la Steve. Huh? What? Fine. Voila. In the mixture, we're gonna be throwing in this asparagus, half a cup of boron cast naturally smoked cheese, half a cup of tannadice smoked ham, six eggs, quarter teaspoon of salt, and a quarter cup of cream, which is in the crust. Oops. Hey, 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 your hand. Hey. Oh, the cream made no difference at all. They look beautiful. Now we're gonna fill them up with the mixture. Just scoop it in. Back in the oven at 375 for an additional 20 minutes and we'll be done. Hey, we did it, Mila, our very first episode. <laughs> Join us at the store, Edible Island, on Friday, May 11th, as I'll be doing an in-store demo of these exact same beautiful keto-friendly Mother's Day quiches. 